Law of attraction is a real thing. So whatever you put out into the universe, you will get back. So if you are putting out in the universe that you want a sugar daddy so bad and you know that you know, you can get so many different things from him and it's something that you truly want. It's something that you want to experience. It's a lifestyle that you want to have. You know, it's something that you want to better for yourself. The universe will align it in the way that is meant for you. It's your girl G is Supreme and as always thank you guys for coming back to my channel I'm gonna get right into this video because y'all like this is such a very big you know how you pray you can pray for whatever you want in this world right you can pray for a sugar daddy as well and the big part of that is manifestations so just to give y'all a backstory of my manifestation journey, I watched The Secret. The Secret is a movie. I definitely suggest all y'all watch it. It literally changed my perspective on the world, my mindset, and just the realities of how the way you think really dictates the outcome of your life. You know, people used to always say, like, be mindful of what you say or be careful what you what you ask for. It's a real thing because sometimes if you are really asking for something to happen, it can manifest itself and it can it can really happen that is literally how i found my sugar daddies like literally all of them i literally put so much into the universe so law of attraction is a technique that people use to attract things that they want to come to their life so if you want to attract a thousand dollars you kind of want to create a routine in order for you to constantly think positivity and constantly think of the things that you want to come into your life. Law of attraction and manifestations are different things, but they work together. But it all comes down to your energy and how you're thinking. So if you want a sugar daddy, I promise you, do this technique and it really will work. Do a morning routine where you write down your goals. Every day you want to look at that paper. You want to read it to yourself, read it in your head or read it out loud. But you want to read it every day. So that way you're constantly seeing something and you have to believe it as well. It's one thing too to sit there and read something, but when you feel it from your gut and you can feel it from your spirit and it's something that you truly, truly want, it works differently. It hits differently, sis, I promise you. And you know, that is literally how my whole life has been. It's just been full of manifestations that I truly want, experiences that I want for myself. So every day you want to work on your brain, you want to work on positivity, you want to work on turning a negative situation into a positive situation. So let's say you're having a bad day, right? Let's say somebody cuts you off in traffic. Go off on them and just let it go. You know, don't dwell on it, don't talk about it all day, don't call everybody your mama up. <laughs> don't tell everybody what happened because all you're doing now is this pushing those negative vibrations into the universe and more negative vibrations are going to come to you you know that's just the law of attraction that's how the world works so you definitely want to just turn those thought processes around you want to make sure that even after you go off because since you can go off it's okay to go off we're human but just know that you want to get back on a positive track look at the positivity within the situation yeah they cut you off but they didn't hit your car you didn't get into an accident you know like just be grateful and show gratitude in that type of light you have to look for the good in every bad situation and i promise you your life will start to change for the better so let's say on your list you want to start a business you want to have money saved up you want to find a sugar daddy you want to find a boyfriend whoever whatever you want to make sure that not only are you writing this stuff down, this is something that you truly want from your heart, truly want from your gut, your spirit, all of that. And the more you want it, the more you think about it, the more you visualize, the more you express it in a positive light, it will come into your life. Never question your faith in yourself. Never question the faith. You have to have faith in this process because that's literally what has got me everything I wanted. 
you know, like my first sugar daddy who got me my breasts, he was not a sugar daddy, y'all. Like I literally met this man, y'all, and like converted him into a sugar daddy. I don't know how it happened. I mean, I know how it happened because of what I wanted and how I manifested something so strong, y'all. Like I knew when I left Philly to go to LA, I was going to find a sugar daddy. There was no ounce of me that I did not know I was gonna find him and I found him and it was just like it was just super crazy to know like that was a real possibility because I have wanted my breasts for years. To have a random stranger come to my life and literally fund my surgery was just like, it just blew my mind. So law of attraction is a real thing. So whatever you put out into the universe, you will get back. So if you were putting out in the universe that you want a sugar daddy so bad and you know that you know, you can get so many different things from him and it's something that you truly want, it's something that you want to experience, it's a lifestyle that you want to have, you know, it's something that you want to better for yourself, the universe will align it in the way that it's meant for you. That might be a husband, that might be a boyfriend, that might be somebody who just might, who might just come by and literally give you money out of nowhere. You know, like that is definitely a possibility. Same thing with my trip to LA recently. Like I didn't tell him that I wanted to go to LA. It just happened in conversation. But LA was so strongly on my mind for the last few months. I've been really wanting to go back to LA. I love LA. That's like where my spirit lives freely and peacefully. <laughs> so it's like when we had the conversation, it was just like such a universal thing because I was I was drawing that energy to want to go to LA in the universe in time because it does not happen instantly but you know it does happen um the universe made the alignment for me to go and that is something that you truly want to just look at always remember that no matter what your biggest struggle was or your biggest accomplishment God universe whoever was there to get you through that situation period so never feel like something is not going to be ever for you but if the environment that you are in is expressing something that is of negativity and not growth and not trying to evolve you will be stagnant and not evolving and that is a very crucial thing y'all you do not want to be stuck because what happens is when you get older you have these patterns and you have these ways and it may not make you the happiest. So you really want to just start working now on law of attraction and manifestations and the power of your mind. Try changing the way you think. Whenever you're mad, just think happy thoughts. You know, like, it may seem really crazy at first. It might seem fake. It's actually going to seem a little bit fake. But what happens is your brain starts to believe it. You know, um, I believe they say it takes like 28 days to create a new pattern or a new behavior. So imagine you doing this for 28 days. Your whole concept will be differently. Your whole outlook on life will be differently because you are starting to climb different vibrations you have never felt before. And I promise y'all, that is how people meet. You meet on a vibrational level. You know, it's no coincidence. It's not, there's no coincidence why you met that person. Everybody comes across your path for a specific reason, like period. So like I said, make sure y'all do some morning routines, you know, meditation, make sure you're watching some manifestation videos, listen to feel good music, listen to things that make you feel good, watch things that make you feel good. Only talk about things that make you feel good. Do not dwell in negativity, drama, just do not dwell in that because that is what's going to hinder your process. So the more you focus on positive positivity, the faster you will excel in law of attraction and your manifestations. I hope that makes sense, y'all. Like, but I really want to talk about this because it's not something that a lot of people talk about, especially when it comes to sugaring. You know, it's the same thing. Whatever you want, the law applies. It does not matter what you want. So don't look at it like it's such a sinful thing to want a sugar daddy because at the end of the day, you are searching for somebody who is going to help grow your life, enhance your life. These are not something to be ashamed of because that is part of your journey that's part of your life it's no different from somebody who's an investor it's no different from somebody who is giving you a loan it just so happened to be 
a man who could be a sugar daddy or even a potential who wants to help you because you manifested this vibration. So I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. I know it's a little bit different, but y'all, this really works. This is a technique that really works. This is something that people use. Every rich person that I've come across has a very positive outlook on life. And it just makes sense to why people receive the blessings that they receive in life. So just keep that in mind, y'all. And thank you so much again, y'all, for coming back to my channel. I truly, truly appreciate it. I hope y'all are staying safe. And don't forget to manifest your life, sis. It is such a possibility. I want everybody to see what the world holds. Like, there's no limitation on anything that you truly want.